Okay, we're back. Um, it looks like I have... Yeah, pretty, pretty good team here. I figured out what I needed to do. So there was a boulder over here. It had to be pushed all the way over here. Right there. And then also the, the ladder that's next to it, that's how you get to Moltres. Um, but I'm not doing that, so I'm going to go over here and fight these guys. Let me put Wax at the top. And, uh, and yes, I'm still playing one-handed, although my wrist is doing quite a bit better. Um, I just want to make sure I rest it as much as possible. Whoops. Hello, wild battle. All right, well, let's do this one really quick. And then I'll fight these two guys. Ooh, a graveler. I should be able to one-hit that with Mega Drain. Cool. All right. Excellent. I think you should grow up soon. All right, let's do these guys. Hopefully Wax will level up. Only the Chosen can pass here. Okay. Um, so yeah, I've just been chilling again today. Um, I did some streaming. I'm like really new to Twitch. Oh my god, look at that thing. So I, I did some streaming of uh, that DS game that I was playing. Let me use Solar Beam, the uh, 999. Yeah, that's not going to work. That attack has such a rare chance to hit. Oh, not stomp. God, that thing looks crazy. Um, yeah, so that was fun. I did that for a couple hours. It was very, like, relaxing, weirdly enough. Um, I get kind of stressed out when I'm, like, recording. At least, like, during the Pokemon playthrough, I'm like, oh god, like... And, and I've played this a million times. I'm completely new. I'm playing, um, 999. And I have no idea what I'm doing, but I just, I felt like really relaxed for whatever reason. I mean, that's a good thing. Um, <laughs> I love that he's got his arms crossed. He's looking at you all angry, like, hmm, what do you think you're going to do with that thunder, Raichu? Oh, good. I missed. <laughs> that, that worked out great. Okay. Um, oh, shoot. Might be better off just using Thunderbolt. Uh, let me try one more time. Okay, great. Third time's the charm, I suppose. Yeah. I also feel like... I feel like I'm getting really close to the end in that game. Um, but there are six endings, so I'm gonna have to play it, you know, six times. Um, if I want to. Uh, Blastoise. I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna try to use Thunder again. Um, and then... Ah, crap. Come on, Thunder. Don't be useless. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah, I, I believe that I'll be out of Victory Road pretty soon. Um, I definitely want to save the Elite Four for the next episode, so that way I can open it, hopefully go through the Elite Four in one go. Um, you know, we'll, we'll have to see what happens. Um, but I think I can do that. It's five battles. As long as they take... Like, less than six minutes each. I should be okay. Alright. I was gonna use that rare candy on wax. Whatever. I'll just fight her really quick. And then, yeah, I have to push a boulder that's over here down a hole and then backtrack. So, let's fight this cool trainer. Oh, wow. A level 43 bell sprout. Why? Why wouldn't you let it evolve? Alright, let's use Lucky. Alright, so yeah, so that's been fun. Um... Don't have too much else going on right now. As has been sort of the, uh, the usual. Um, I did get an email from, uh, from my boss and she was like, it's about to get busy at work again. And I was like, thank God. <laughs> um, I think I've mentioned this before, but the summer season is really slow for concert venues because, uh, so many bands are doing like festivals during the summer. Um, I will stay here. Um, so yeah, then they start doing like regular tours in the U.S. in uh, September. So that'll be great. Great to have more regular work. Of course, you know, next year it's going to be the same thing. So I'm going to have to either find more side work or just like save up for the summer. Oh, I see. They had all the evolutions. That's cool. Wow. Kind of looks like a banana. I mean, I know it's like a, a pitcher plant, but the body part kind of has the shape and texture of a banana. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, everyone's like, oh, I gotta put away for winter. It's like, I have to save up for summer. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, let me just... Where's that? It's more like I want to use it because, you know, that way I have more space in my bag. It'll clear up two spaces. Um, okay. So we should learn... Excellent. Razor leaf. I'm gonna delete... Yes, please. I'm gonna delete poison powder um, because my Butterfree has toxic and if I want to poison someone I'll just use Butterfree. Okay, so now let me just save in case I find out that I screwed up and like it actually learns like something amazing later. I mean I know it doesn't but um, we'll just evolve wax really quick and then we'll be on our way. Where's that least done? There we go. Alright. Oh my god! I can't believe it! It's exactly what I knew was gonna happen! Cool, got my victory bell. Excellent. So yeah, hopefully, um, hopefully he'll be even more useful. Um, ooh. I just kind of reflexively, like, put both my hands on the controller. Nope. That is not happening right now. Um, okay. I'm gonna move Cleo to the front, make sure I've got a repel on. Um, just for the sake of making this go a little faster. Where's the repels? There we go. Okay. And now, we'll go over here. And I have to push this down here. Um, I wonder if I can fall down the hole. So that way I don't have to go all the way around. Let's try it. <laughs> Um, yeah, cool. And I think I have to push this over here. So, yeah, okay, cool. So yeah, straight shot. Excellent. That'll open up that space. And then I can exit, I believe. So I think what I'm going to do, because like I said, I, I would like to wait, um, open up the next episode, you know, right, ready to go for the Elite Four. I think I'm just going to maybe train in this area for a bit. I know I fought all the trainers. Um, uh, I guess I'll have to wait until my repel wears off, but um, I can just get into some wild battles. You know, we can find something to talk about. <laughs> and uh, yeah, then we'll be, uh, we'll be ready. I think, I hope. All right, go here and then here. Let me make sure there wasn't an item there. I always like when you see a rock by itself like that. I guess not. That's that's not cool. I guess it's just there so you couldn't push that in. Ah, that makes sense. All right, and here's the exit. Oh my God, you guys, we did it. And now, once I go in here, um, I'll be able to fly to like directly to here. I won't have to go through the victory road ever again. I think. Where's the end cheese? Okay. Ah, here we go. So yeah, we've got a Pokemon Center here and there's a shop so I can buy fancy stuff. What's she have to say? From here on, you face the Elite Four one by one. If you win, a door opens to the next trainer. Good luck. Yeah, I'm not ready for that yet. Ooh, what's on sale? What is that? Doesn't say. Um, I'm pretty sure I can buy like all of the good stuff here. So let's see. Ultra Balls, full restores. Yes, we need that. Um, that will put your HP to max and also clear any poisoning or sleep or whatever. Max Potion. I still have a bunch of lemonades. Um, okay, cool. I was hoping they had um, max revives, but uh, yeah, I don't think you can buy those. Um, I know I've got a couple of them, though. Okay, so let me go talk to this guy. Oh, yeah, that's my buddy. Alright. So let me try to remember off the top of my head. It has been a while since I've done... Okay, cool. My repel were off. Um, if I want to change Pokemon, I can do that here. Let me just heal up. I know there's, there's Agatha 
I think she's the second one that has ghosts. I know I can blow through that with Clefairy, with psychic moves. I think the first guy is Rock and Ground. I forgot his name. Oh, Bruno, I think. Um, there's Lorelei, who has Ice type, I think. Um, so yeah, let me just go back to um, Victory Road. I can probably get a lot of um, leveling for Wax. Um, because it's a lot of, like, rock type in there. Um, and then there's Lance, who has dragons. So that's, obviously Lance is going to be, like, super hard. And then you fight your rival, who's going to be, like, super, super tough. Which, am I going the wrong way? I'm going the wrong way. Okay. <laughs> um, so yeah, I, uh, I think I want, like, everybody to be in the 40s, at least. Um, let me just stay in... Okay. <laughs> I was trying to do something. Um, I was like trying to get into wild battles and like, I just wasn't, I was walking around like multiple times. Oh my God. Uh, that almost looks like a, like part of a wing from behind. Oh, so weird. Um, let's use razor leaf. Let me actually switch these around a little bit. Um, okay what razor leaf can do should be good um should be able to blow through most uh rock and ground and maybe even water just with razor leaf and then i've got solar beam as a backup and like mega drain if i need to um you know if i need to suck health um yeah i was like okay so i'm not getting into battles let me try to to go somewhere you know i'm going to be like all right i want to go to that exit right there and then i was getting into battles and i was like it knows <laughs> it's just Whatever you want, it's going to give you the opposite of that. <laughs> All right. So I'm kind of, uh, actually, I'm going to move that to the top. So that way, because I'm still playing one-handed. <laughs> that way I don't have to use the D-pad at all. <laughs> um, yeah, what game should I play next? Hopefully, like, so I was remembering, because it's been like four or five days, and I'm still having trouble using my hand. I remembered a few years ago, I slipped and fell down some stairs and it probably sounds like I'm like super clumsy and I am. Um, I was, when I fell down the stairs, I was like pretty drunk. Um, but also, I don't know if it's like this in other places, but in the Bay area, a lot of homes have like staircases that aren't up to code. Um, they're like either too narrow or like even the staircase I have here at my house currently, um, it curves and when it curves, the steps are like, like three inches wide. So you really have to be careful on the stairs. And I was at this guy's house and like, I think actually like he was staying in the attic of this house and we're trying to go downstairs and the stairs were really narrow and they had carpet on them. So I just slid. And I couldn't even catch myself. I landed like directly on my tailbone. Um, and that hurt for like a couple months after the fact. And I was like, I really hope, which I isn't cut because I'm on a much higher level. I really hope that my arm isn't out of commission for months. That would super suck. Um, you know, I mean, I'd, I'd get through it. Like there are people who, you know, only have one arm from birth or, you know, permanently and they get by just fine. Um, the only other issue is, um, I was, one of the things that I, I could do, I was like, oh, okay, well, I'm trying to like roll, I get some tape off of a roll of tape and you really need two hands to do that. And I'm trying to like, you know, I'm trying to bite it. And I was like, okay, well I can like kind of hold it like with my toes. So I was, I, I hurt my left wrist and I was born without toes on my left foot. <laughs> So like left foot's also kind of useless, um, if I'm trying to do that. So I was like, man, this is just a huge pain in the ass. <laughs> like at least it could, it couldn't be like the opposite, like, you know, have one, have your left leg working and your, your right arm so that way you can like cross and do stuff. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, I'm still alive. Like I haven't starved to death. I'll be just fine. Um, but it kind of sucks, you know, especially cause like, the whole reason I started talking about this, you know, what game should I play next? You know, I'd like to play an action game, but I might have to pick another like slow moving RPG 
or maybe a puzzle game um, that I can play one-handed if my wrist doesn't heal soon. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's still... It's definitely improved. Um, like, I can kind of grip things. It's just painful. Um, but yeah, still still not up for, like, you know, rapid D-pad movements. <laughs> okay. Let me see, like, how close is he to leveling up? Because I'd like to get some levels onto Snorlax as well. Um, also, whoops, I meant to go to stats. Um, you know, I haven't really done this. I haven't done any grinding on screen. Oh, that's a lot. Well, hopefully I'll encounter some more, um, like, onyxes and gravelers. Okay. Yeah, it's just... Maybe after I kind of exhaust wax, I'll put Snorlax at the top. And then I'll kind of switch out. Um... And, and have, like, Cleo come in. And so it's just, like, halfway. Um, Alright. Let's cut. This is going okay. I could put a repel on if I wanted to only get, like, the higher level ones. But how much how much XP is one Machop give me? 300? That's really not a lot. <laughs> um, and, I, like, if it's a level 40 Graveler... I can kill that in one hit with Razor Leaf. I don't know, we'll see. Oh, hey, look, Onyx. Just what I needed. Level 42. Alright, Razor Leaf. I guess that's all that's here. There's nothing else I really want to catch. It's just Geodude, Graveler, Machop, Machoke, Onyx. Um, um, Zubat. <laughs> like, I don't know if I encountered anything else. I still don't have a Zubat. Um, okay, so that was that was twice as much. That's something. Alright. This guy. Um. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what else to. <laughs> I talk about while I'm doing this. But. Uh, okay. Let me. I don't know. That's that's where I came from. <laughs> it's like let me mosey over here. Maybe there's a wider space to to walk around in. Or I can move that boulder out of the way. But all right, Machop. Okay. Yeah, I've only I haven't even gained a level yet, have I? <laughs> Maybe I should work on Snorlax, but I don't know. Really, I want Snorlax for the Elite Four just to be able to take hits, like, while I'm healing up other people. <laughs> um, oh yeah, see, that's not a bigger area at all. Alright, I'll just keep going in this stretch. <laughs> um, Alright, Onyx. you level 45. I can't remember, I think I caught an Onyx um, while I was leveling up last time. have to double check. I also like, I nicknamed all my Pokemon. And um, w when you look in the Pokemon boxes, it's like, it doesn't tell you what they are. It just has their nickname. And I'm like, I don't fucking remember what I named all of these Pokemon. So you have to like actually withdraw them to see what they are. And I'm like, uh, fuck this. I should have written it down. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could go back and watch the footage, but like, um, a lot of it I did off screen, so yeah. All right. Damn it! When is he gonna level up? I would really like him to be at least level forty. Um, I think he's gonna come in handy for the, the first member of the Elite Four. Um, if I'm remembering that correctly. All right, cool, Graveler. Yes, this is going great. One hitting all of the rock guys. Getting some XP. I'm feeling good about where I'm at. Um, yeah, I'd love to be able to just kind of blow through the first member of the Elite Four with Wax. Get through Agatha. Get through all the ghosts with Cleo. Um, 
for the ice types because a lot of them I think are like water and ice. Um, you know, Charizard might not be super perfect for that. Um, but I've got Pikachu. Um, or Raichu, I'm sorry. I keep, uh, keep messing up his name. Um, and, uh, and with, with Charizard having Slash, like, that will take down a lot of stuff. Um, obviously Lance is going to be super hard no matter what, because fuck his team of dragons. Um, but yeah, I think I'll, I think I'll be okay. Um, as long as I just buff up a little bit, um, spend a few more minutes doing this, um, probably level up a bit more off screen. And then when I come back, um, hopefully I'll come back. <laughs> and, um, I will be, uh, I'll be like right at the door of the Elite Four and hopefully I will feel confident and ready for that. So, um, oh my God. So I'm laughing because my partner came in the room and he's trying to be really quiet. But the result of that is that it's really, really funny to watch. <laughs> uh, it's totally fine. Oh my god. Yeah, so I think after this I might hop back onto... Well, we'll see. If I still feel like playing Pokemon, because um, I'm like surprisingly addicted to that DS game, 999. Whoops. Uh, using the D-pad, using this one-handed, I'm kind of like messing up my directions. I like, I really want to know what happens. Um, I, I do, I highly recommend that game because I love, I love mystery games. I love horror games. I love um, like room escape games where you have to kind of go hunting for stuff in the room and like, you know, flip switches and solve puzzles. Um, some of them I find like a little too hard. This one feels like a really good level of difficulty. Um, I've only had to like peek at a walkthrough a couple of times. So, um, like I said, there are six endings. So I'm going to be playing that for a while, but I'm like really, really excited to figure out like what the greater mystery is. So yeah, if you like, uh, if you like that kind of game, I highly recommend it. But yeah, I might, uh, I might hop back on Twitch and stream that for a while. Um, or I might play Pokemon. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see how my arm feels. Uh, cause yeah, I would really love to play, um, one of my other favorite Game Boy games from when I was a kid, uh, which is Donkey Kong. Um, but that requires like a lot of really precise movements. Like it's a puzzle platformer. Um, and I'm not sure my arm's going to be up for that, but we'll see. If, if not soon, I will definitely be doing that eventually. Holy shit, it's a Venomoth. Um, let me switch to Charizard for this. All right, so we also know now that there are Venomoths in here. Um, I wonder what else. All right. Uh, did I? Damn it. <laughs> All right, that wasn't too bad. I still haven't learned Flamethrower. I think he'll learn it soon. I hope. Uh, I don't know. Really, like, once I'm a little bit higher, like, I'm just gonna be using Slash for everything. <laughs> That's why I dropped that, uh, PP up onto Slash. I feel like it's really worth it. Okay. Just a little bit more. And then we'll take off. Okay. Yeah, I'll probably spend some time on Nemu. I think that's what I'll do on my Snorlax. Um, Cause yeah, I, even though he has such high HP, he's only level 31 and that, that feels way too low to go to the Elite Four with. But um, uh, it's gonna take a long ass time to level him up too. Oh well, maybe I'll just put some TV on in the background and zone out and just sort of go on autopilot. <laughs> okay. Um, so wax just grew. Let me, let me check on. Yeah, I think, I think these guys are going to be fine. Uh, Picarikun, Murderface, Lucky, and Cleo. And like wax is really getting there. Um, so let me check his stats. Um, all right, 827 to level up. So let's get into a couple battles with Nemu. And then I'll probably cut this episode. 
And yeah, we'll come back and we'll kick the Elite Four's ass. Hmm. Wonder if I can use maybe strength or head, but I'm still oh yeah, I him earthquake. I'm still not sure like you know, is strength a good move? Like, I never really relied on it, and I don't think it is. Um let me try using headbutt. But I mean I had to have oh perfect. I had to have someone knowing strength on my permanent team. You just use it too much in this game. Um, yeah, I kind of, I was more comfortable putting away, uh, you know, my bird and not having fly unless I go and switch out. Oh, it's another fucking Venomoth. All right, let's try headbutting that too. I don't know, I'm lower level, but something might, uh, oh no, haha, it didn't affect me. <laughs> that stands for, well, it's in there. Uh, leech life. Uh. Okay, so three headbutts should do it. That's not terrible, actually. No, not Sidebeam. Oh my god. <laughs> it's still like, I think it, hitting it three times to get all the XP just for, yeah, just for Nemo is more worth it than like swapping out. Okay, well, I think I'll, I'll be doing that for a while. I think I will be fighting with Snorlax. Um, so let me see now, now how many. 3,800. Okay, that's a lot. That's probably maybe six or seven battles if I encounter stuff that's in the 40s. All right, well, that won't take too long. All right, well, thank you so much for watching. And yeah, look forward to next time when we will take on the Elite Four. And you know, cross your fingers for me that I can do it all in one go. All right, thank you so much for watching. Take care.